Facebook. Hello, boys and girls. Welcome to the Big Brother Show in good old Wasteland. And it would seem that my sneaky tactics worked. I was able to. I was able to <coughs> sneak away from the game. result of the capture will have uh, uh, will have wide margins around them. Whoop! Well, turns out that uh, Formal fact Factory has a really handy cropper tool. So the margins will be more evenly distributed. I didn't want to cut them out entirely but
you not carry grenades? Grenades are very handy, especially the hand grenades. Come upon the rail nomads camp. Ornery looking longhorn cattle wander among dusty tents from which sullen faces appear. In the background, a ramshackle collection of railroad cars, patched with wood, hide, and an odd piece of corrugated aluminum, sits on a rail siding. 
Two of the cars, the locomotive at the front and the caboose at the rear, appear to be in better condition than the others. As you approach, a strained silence falls over the camp and you grow uncomfortable under the collective gaze of the assembled nomads. Finally, one of the nomads steps forward. Welcome, Rangers. I am the brakeman of this train. I'd be honored if you would visit me in the caboose before leaving our camp. In the meantime, please accept our hospitality. The brakeman turns and strides back into the camp. Okay, so I have visited this location and uh, point one, we were killed by some local puppies. So I'll save the game. Point two, the uh, frontman gave me something, some delivery request, but I failed to pay attention. Okay, hello. The brakeman tells you, take this visa card and give it to Head Crusher and Quartz. Oh, As the brakeman passes you the card, the sunlight catches the dove hologram and glints brightly. You slide it into your breast pocket as he turns and leaves without another word. Okay, now, now I understand what he wanted. Because... Uh As you pass the open doorway of this car, you're almost overcome by the strong odor of fermented cactus fruit. As your eyes become accustomed to the darkness of the car, you can make out a straw-colored floor littered with numerous bottles of Dr. B. Bilios Balfour snake squeezes. At the back of the car lolls a rotund bearded figure, rocking back and forth as if the mere act of sitting offered a difficult feat of balance. Finally, seeming to take notice of you, the shadowy figure issues an invitation. Welcome to my humble abode, gentlefolk. Step on in. <laughs> right back at you.
swimming. Try with everybody. I only wanted to look at the waters. I wanted to see if I could fill the canteens and whatnot. explains to you. I sent out my second in command to look into a series of murders. You notice the bishop nervously twisting a ruby ring around his finger.
explosives. Speed. 
Thanks because that's uh, where I get the stuff.
this is good. Let's report. Walking again, yay! And now I'll say. about Mayor Pedros, but others are held hostage too. Felicia Pedros, his wife, is our friend. We think she's been moved to the outlaw hideout. We hope you'll try to rescue her. And remember what Ellen said when you go to the stagecoach inn. They smile and leave. I have no idea what Ellen said.
hope I didn't have uh, the pistol out. Okay, in which case, load. Could I just put it away? Have you heard about the Ugly's gang? Is this his, uh, I don't know, answer or, or is it actually information? Okay. Who wants to know? The razor wants to know. At the boy, okay. Bartender, we would actually have to 
practicing certain skills gives you improvements.
ran into this uh, during my uh, yesterday's run and uh, <coughs> I had no idea what, uh, what it meant. Okay, and 
people are on my way. So let's change the order of him. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. 